Rocket League is all about speed. The quicker you can react to the sometimes very unpredictable action on the field, the more effective you're going to be for your team. I'm sure you figured out by now how to use boost to go faster, but you may not realize just how important it is to all areas of the game. When I started playing, I had no idea how to manage or conserve boost. When I ran over a boost pad or capsule, I pretty much just used all the boost right away and looked for more as soon as I ran out. But if you're smart about saving and feathering your boost in key moments, you're going to do way better than I did, making key plays for your team on both ends of the field. One of the easiest ways to rise through the Rocket League ranks is to simply collect more boost from the small pads found all over the field, rather than the large capsules on the edges. Focusing on the small pads keeps you in position and in the play, which will put you at a major advantage over everyone else scrambling for those big boosts. Another key to smart boost usage is to stop using boost once you get supersonic. Being supersonic is when you're basically at your max speed, and once you get there, you can stay at that speed without using more boost, as long as you don't turn too sharply. In other words, if you're smart, you can fly around the field faster than everyone else while using way less boost and staying in position. Do this, and you'll be better than pretty much 99% of the player base. And I mean, I get it, those big capsules are tempting, but don't fall for it. Go for these instead, and you'll be crushing the competition in record speed. Thank you